You've heard of it, haven't you? The legend of Sparta? When I was young, my father would tell me stories about it. Long ago, in ancient times, a demon rebelled against his own kind for the sake of the human race. With his sword, he shut the portal to the demonic realm and sealed the evil entities off from our human world. But since he was a demon himself, his power was also trapped on the other side. I never believed it. I thought it was just a child's fairy tale. But I discovered that this so-called legend wasn't a myth at all. Sparta existed. How do I know? Well, I met the sons of Sparta. Both of them. Though the same blood of their father flowed through their veins, the two battled each other fiercely like arch enemies. It seemed as if they derived some sort of twisted pleasure from this brotherly fighting. Sorry, not open for business yet. <laughs> I haven't even picked a name for this joint, and I'm already getting calls. You a customer too? <laughs> well, if you want to use the bathroom, help yourself. The toilet's in the back. Is your name Dante, son of Sparta? Where did you hear that? From your brother. He sent this invitation for you. Please, accept it. Invitation, huh? He's getting crazy. Let's rock. Don't 
spit on it. Damn it! You guys totally wrecked my shop, and I haven't even named it yet! You're gonna pay for that. It's been nearly a year since we last met. Where does the time go? No doubt, you've got some fun planned for me. Right, Virgil? I come well. Doesn't it excite you? The Timon the Gru has revived. The Great One who once ruled this earth as the medium between the human world and the demon world. Isn't it a magnificent view? The greatest minds of their time, those who revered evil, constructed this glorious edifice. Now, after two millenniums of confinement, it can at last fulfill the purpose for which it was intended. That's none of my concern. Did he have it? Of course. He's taking good care of it. After all, it is the only memento left from the mother you both lost. But he has no idea of its true power.
in this land. You, who are powerless, are not worthy to set foot here. Wow. I've never seen a talking mutt before. You know, in a dog show, you definitely take first place. You want me? You can make a mockery of me! Easy, Fido. How about I take you out for a walk? Come on, puppy. Let's go. You'll regret this, you learn! It's showtime. Come on. You are not human, are you? Who knows? I'm not even sure myself. Regardless, you have proved your strength. I acknowledge your ability. Take my soul and go forth. You have my blessing. <laughs> Looks like we have an uninvited guest. Is that so? A human. A woman. I'm afraid I should ask the uninvited one to leave. That is what you want. Actually, I happen to be acquainted with that woman. Devil boy. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Better listen to what I have to say, lad. This tower here is very sturdy. You see? Your tricks will do no good. No good! Zip it. Or I'll pierce that big nose. That could be a problem. Just hear me out. You've got nothing to lose, right? My name is Jester, and I know a thing or two about this place. That thing there is a power generator for this entire sector. In order to open the door, you need to apply a little something to it first. 
Do you know what that is, kid? Or is that too difficult for you? <laughs> Get to the point, or you want to keep on dancing? Actually, I prefer a sword to be my partner. May I have this dance, my lady? <laughs> Is what the something is. Remember that, kid. Write it down on your hand if you don't trust your head. <laughs> I see. Thanks. <laughs> you still piss me off, though. For destroying the lock for me, devil boy! And welcome to hell! Please accept my gift. Don't be humble. Just take it. After all, we're bunnies, aren't we? <laughs> <laughs> Isn't that special? To be honest, I'm expecting something a little better than this. Welcome to hell! you two gonna keep carrying on like this? In case you didn't get the hint, I'll spell it out. Your guest wants to go through. Got it? Our job here is to go on this pool. That's right. We can't let you pass. Someone stronger than us. Someone who can control us. My name is Agni, and my name is Rudra. You shall take us with you. We can be a great help to you. Okay, but on one condition. What is it? Name it. No, talking. Fair enough, as you wish. Yeah! 
No talking. Good. Well, well. You've grown stronger. Go to hell. You point a gun at me? Your own kin? Your dear papa? The only family I ever had was my mother. And she's dead! You break my heart. After all, it was I who gave you your name. My darling daughter. Well, this is my kind of rain. No wonder the sky looks so funny today. Let me go! Let you go? <laughs> but it would be a waste if you ended up as just a pretty stain. <laughs> Can you show your thanks by shooting me? <sighs> Whatever. Do as you please. So he's a demon too. I'm beginning to think I've got rotten luck with women. You showed up. You sure know how to throw a party. No food, no drinks, and the only babe just left. My sincerest apology, brother. I was so eager to see you, I couldn't concentrate on preparations for the bash. Whatever. At any rate, it's been a whole year since we last met. 
How about a kiss from your little brother? Or better yet, how about a kiss from this? So, this is what they call a heartwarming family reunion, eh? You got that right.
once cried out in fear of this tower. Timon grew. A foundation that brought out fear. Fear. <laughs> yes. Fear. Can't you feel it? The rage and agonies of the people. Those who were confined here, with their desires for evil being unfulfilled. It was all because Sparta slammed the door to the demon world in their faces. What's wrong? Nothing. So this is the next stage. Wait! If you're asking for a date, forget it. Because I make it a point not to go out with women who shoot me in the head. Date a demon? <laughs> I'm not that desperate. Besides, I really don't care for guys who stink like blood. <sighs> you're right. You'd think so, wouldn't you? All right. I'll help you. Your father was a handsome devil. But you're no slouch yourself.
welcome back. Soon we will reach the lair of judgment. Temenic Guru will finally regain its full function and lead us into the demon world. The world where Sparta's power has been sealed. <laughs> and the one who will lift the incantation is you. His own son. It must be fate. Does that woman really bother you? What are you talking about? Why didn't you kill her? Perhaps because she's your daughter? Did some pesky fatherly love get in your way? That's none of your... Oh. Oh. To further your study of the black arts, you sacrificed your loving wife to become a devil as well. Knowing this, I thought you'd be more useful to me. But I was wrong. No wonder your attainment of power is incomplete. What about you? You're an incomplete being as well. Both demon and human blood mingle in your veins. Shut Now that the final door is open, I have no use for you. Kill him. So what if I did? Ooh, I love a fast woman. Shut up! He was obsessed with becoming the devil. So much he killed his own wife. For that he butchered innocent people too. He's the most vile kind of creature. <laughs> to top it off, that filthy scum is my father. Well, we have something in common. I have a dysfunctional family, too. And what would you know about family? You're a demon. This is my father. My family. This was all supposed to end by my hand. Aren't you gonna shoot? <laughs> well, that's a switch. Just go. I don't care anymore. Hmm. 
Family, huh? Where am I? It's dark, I can't see anything. You're still alive, I see. Mary? Is that you? What's happening? Where's your mother? My mother? You killed her, remember? Yes. That's right. I killed her. With my own hands. What horrible thing have I done? I was too weak. I succumbed to his influence. You mean... you were possessed? Father? <clears throat> yes, I was manipulated. Manipulated by a devil named Virgil. Virgil? He's attempting to bring the demon world back to this modern day. A world that Sparta once sealed off. Sparta? I thought he was a myth. If the demons return, this world will be thrown into chaos. Stop him. Stop Virgil. Me? You're such a sweet child. Just like your mother. Father! Father! your mother ever teach you how to use a door? Father, come on, man, cut me some slack. Shut you up. The bug 
wants to crack on me when someone talks more than I do. Don't act so rashly, my boy. I've got a doozy of a story for you. But if you snuff out my voice like that, I won't be able to tell it now, will I? <laughs> I thought I was a goner, for sure. <laughs> You saw it too, didn't you? That huge tower jutting out of the ground. That thick shaft that causes women to shudder. It's actually a tunnel, linking the demonic domain to the human world. And of course, your brother Virgil is the one who controls it by using your mommy's amulet. Amulet? He's headed to the control room in the basement. If you don't hop down there quick like a bunny, he'll open the gate to hell! Isn't that a scary thought? And you're telling me this because... Oops! I forgot to mention one teeny little item. <laughs> that gizmo there is actually the key to move forward. But the tricky thing is, it sucks the souls of those who hold it. So I think you'd better hurry! <laughs> But, in return for your soul, it'll give you power. Marvelous, isn't it? Just let your young spirit drive you and go for it! <laughs> Wish you would have told me that in the first place. You big mouth moron. Horsepower. A chicken race with a horse, huh? Fair enough. First chicken, now gladiator. This just keeps getting better and better. Too bad there's nobody here to enjoy the show!
Frodo! I told you that I remembered your wretched scent. No matter where you went to, you could never hide from me. You... You're not the one I faced before. But this smell... There are two of them. That excellent spot I had two sons. Why isn't this working? Is there something missing? Must more blood be shed? You seem to be in a bad mood. Dante. So, my mother's amulet is the key that unlocks the door to the demon world. <laughs> Good plan, Pop. Just the opposite, actually. Originally, it was the key to the demon world, but was given to humans as a gift. It doesn't matter to me one way or the other. More importantly, I've come all this way. I'm sure you have time for one more game, right? Why not? After all, we share the same blood. I'll just use more of yours to undo Daddy's little spell. So, you want a piece of me, literally? Okay, bro. Come and get it, if you can. <laughs> Sorry, but this is no place for a little girl. So beat it. Shut up! You forced him into this! Is that what you think? Foolish girl. Bravo! Bravo! I never dreamed that things would go so smoothly. Well done, everyone! Well done! You. Don't be a bad girl, Mary. <laughs> Or you can expect a spanking from Daddy later. Just as gonna spank you, but spank you on the bum, buffoon. I don't know where you came from, but you don't belong here. Now leave! <laughs> Zowie, that was close. 
But you've taken quite a trouncing today, haven't you, Virgil? You could have chopped me into confetti by now if you were in tip-top condition. Damn you. You have lost. <sighs> Because you underestimated humans. What's going on? Good girl. Pure and innocent. Just like your mother. You bastard! It's time for your spanking, my dear. <laughs> Spell didn't break. Mm, Virgil. You have the two amulets and Sparta's blood. You had everything you needed to unleash the evil. I told you before, I don't like anybody who has a bigger mouth than mine. You are wounded and weak. <laughs> Even I can do <laughs> this to you. <laughs> Two amulets, a set of Sparta's blood. Now, I need one more key. He sacrificed two things to suppress the tremendous force of this tower. His own devil's blood and a mortal priestess. I needed you in whose body flows the same blood as the sacrificed woman. His spell cannot be undone without your blood. It was quite a ride, you know. <laughs> if any of you had died before getting here, our little plan would have gone to waste. Ha! Therefore, my job was to make you battle each other in order to weaken you. But at the same time, I had to guide you here and make sure that you were kept alive. I even went so far as dressing like a complete idiot. <laughs> it's time for bed, Mary. You can visit your dear mother. <laughs> Whoa! Try me. It's time for the clown to bow out, Arkham. Dude, the show's over. Impressive. I expected nothing less from the Devil's descendants. But aren't you forgetting something, Virgil? The spell is broken. What do you think will happen next? Let's welcome chaos.
gonna go. Yes, I'm going to finish him off. Well, you might as well forget it, because you're no match for him. Regardless, I must go. I had a chance to stop him before, but I couldn't. I'm responsible for all this mess. Responsible? Does it bother you that much? He's my father. Besides, who else can undo what he's done? A demon like you wouldn't understand. Father and family, huh? Well, I'll go too. But you better hurry if you don't want me to take all the credit. Locks the threads that make us dance finger and toe. We surrender, in joy, to the lowest of the foul and rank. We submerge through darkness, rancid filth. Hour by hour, we move downward, ever closer to hell, in a slow, steady gait. Now. Let the world resonate. Sloth. Gluttony. Greed. Envy. Lust. Wrath.
What's wrong? You tired? Then stand back. I'll take care of this. No, you stand back. I told you, you can't do it. Don't you get it? This is not a human's job. You are the one who doesn't get it. It's not something you can reason with. It has nothing to do with me being a human and you being a demon. I'm driven by the inability to forgive him. My soul is screaming, demanding me to kill him. That's enough motivation to keep me going. Besides, this is my family matter. You should stay out of it. Okay, lady. I get the picture now, but I can't just sit back and watch either. I'm pretty pissed at him too, you know. Now, get out of my way, or there'll be some consequences. Fair enough. I wasn't planning on letting any demons live anyway. Not even one. started with my father sealing the entrance between the two worlds and now my brother's trying to break that spell and turn everything into demonville this is my family matter too quite frankly at first i didn't give a damn but because of you i know what's important now i know what i need to do Wait. Trust me. I'll make things right for you. That's what my soul is telling me to do. Use this. How much is it gonna cost me? You can give me your name. Dante.
you're here to ask me some questions. Well, too bad. I've already answered them myself. I don't need you anymore. Huh, thought I lost my shadow for a sec. Stick your nose in other families' business. Come on, dude. Don't you have any hobbies? So hideous. Can't you tell by looking at me? Anyway, that shape suits you better. Let's begin the events. to retrieve my power. You can't handle it. Look at you, making a big dramatic entrance and stealing my spotlight. What? You don't possibly believe that he deserves to be our main event now, do you? 
Now that you mention it, you're right. You should come to realize you cannot control the power of Sparta. You're wasting your time, buddy. I think he needs to learn the hard way. Classy for someone's dying words. surprise here I was looking for you and lo and behold you come to me Mary don't ever call me that again my mother was the only one who could say my name wait please do you really want to shoot me can you shoot me your own father I done wrong! Even the heroic Sparta sacrificed a woman so that he could become a legend. I wish to be a god! And I sacrificed one miserable human being for that reason. That is all. Was that really so awful? I have some unfinished business to take care of. Help me, Mary. Mary died a long time ago. My name is Lady. Goodbye, Father. <gasps> no!
can have this, Dante. It's mine. It belongs to a son of Sparta. Leave me and go, if you don't want to be trapped in the demon world. I'm staying. This place was our father's home. You're still here. I need that back. No late charges, I hope. Hmm. I'll think about it.
We should be fine for now. But I'm sure they'll be back soon. Very soon. Are you crying? It's only the rain. The rain already stopped. The devils never cry. I see. Maybe somewhere out there, even a devil may cry when he loses a loved one. Don't you think? Maybe. By the way... <laughs> looks like we're gonna be busy for a while. Well, bring it on. Love this. This is what I live for. I'm absolutely crazy about it. What happened next? Nothing really. We took care of all the remaining devils, and that was it. I still have a job to do that's far from done, which is to eliminate every last demon. I need to ensure that monsters like my father never come about again. And he promised to help me hunt down the demons, even though he's part one himself. But now I realize that there are humans as evil as any devil, as well as kind and compassionate demons in this universe. At least I've found one so-called devil who is able to shed tears for those he cares about. That's enough for me to believe in him. Now I can start my business. Oh, speaking of a kind devil, he finally decided on a name for his shop. It took him quite a while to pick one. Wanna know the name? Devil, devil May, May Cry. Cry. Fun fight with the Prince of Darkness. If my father did it, I should be able to do it too. 